And I always look at him and I'm like, why am I always dressed like a tail? Do you want that to be the topic of our first video? Maybe. We could do that. Hi, I'm Mary. I'm Meg. Oh. <laughs> and uh, since we had so much fun making this random YouTube video before, we thought, you know what? Well, I thought interviewing Meg would be just the best video. Seriously. Okay, so cardigans. We need to talk about the cardigans. <laughs> <laughs> would you care to describe the one that you're wearing now and where you acquired it? Um, so I'm going to get story. This is one of my many cardigans. This one happens to be green. It's a green cardigan. And it's got lovely detailing. It's got oh my some here. <laughs> some ribbon. So, um, would you say you wear a cardigan daily? Yeah, oh yeah. And that puts you up in the ranks of Mr. Rogers. Yeah. And other famous cardigan yeah. people. I'd say Bill company. Cosby, but Gil Bill Cosby wasn't a cardigan guy. He was a pullover guy. Yeah, mm, yeah. I'm not going to count it. You're not going to count no. it? Mm -hmm. So, um... Close, though. Okay, opportunities to wear cardigans. Post-running. Do you have a mm. post-running cardigan? I do. You I do. Do you have a post-running cardigan? It's other hot. opportunities to wear cardigans. First date. I would wear a cardigan on first date. I've been told that I'm not allowed to wear a cardigan on first date, but I would. Okay. I think it's I think it's acceptable. I think that yep. you know, right. you gotta show them what you got right <laughs> off the bat. You mean your your cardigans should basically say, "This is what I have." Yeah. I have incredible cardigans. Yeah. Yeah. I think people need to know that. Okay. When they when they start dating, I think it's an important fact. And Meg, can we just talk about the fact that you're a collar popper? Uh, I'm an occasional collar popper. An occasional collar popper? Yeah. But you're a collar popper. Yes. Yes. Yeah. On certain shirts, I will pop the collar. No. <laughs> on, on certain days, I will. Also this pop totally the collar. goes against how I view collar poppers. You are, I think, the exception and not the rule. Oh, thank you. I hope. I think so. Except you know, the private education and. Yeah. Being from Connecticut. I guess you are a stereotypical collar popper. But personality wise, I mean, you're much nicer than most collar poppers that I know. Thank you. That's good. Um, um, <laughs> did I you have any questions for me? No, but um, the main. Well, today's collar popping is for a specific reason because my dear friend Daniel. Oh! <laughs> You can, that's where I learned oh my God! the technique of collar popping is <laughs> in high school for camouflage. That's when I started, is uh, when things need to be covered. And How old is Daniel? Didn't wear makeup. He's 24 years old. Oh my God! Look at that! I forget. Doesn't it help if you put like toothpaste on it? I didn't know it's that. It's been a while since I've had a hickey. <laughs> it's been a day. It's a day. Present. Yeah. Current. I cannot Current. believe I chose to talk about the collar popping and she actually did it for a reason. Yep. This is the many things of Meg. And now we're going to break this up into different segments, different chapters, days of conversations with Meg. Because Meg it's is an interesting person. No, <laughs> for instance, today, what has inspired bringing out this computer and sitting here and talking at it like this is the fact that I'm sitting here laughing my face off and in comes Meg and sits down. I'm eating dinner, watching TV. I find the episode of Golden Girls incredibly funny. Meg sits down and says, so what show is this? Ladies and gentlemen, Meg Cook. You've seen Golden Girls. Sorry. You Golden Girls fans. I feel like we should have a sign off if this is going to be a regular thing. Okay. Uh, maybe we should pause and think this out and then come back. No, 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 we're going no, right gotta through go now. This. Okay, I'm not editing um, this. This is going up. I'm kind of tough. I feel up. I don't know. It's a very hunched little video. Yeah. We should really figure out how we're going to video these, because the lighting's bad, and... But I kind of like that it's always bad. Okay. It could be a consistent thing. The other ones are bad. Poor quality. Bad. Um, so... Little planning. This is... I'm Mary. I'm Meg. Um, I just want to be an epic, epic diva. diva. Oh, it's working. Okay. One, two, three, four, two, three. At last, my love has come along. My lonely days are over. And love. 